are laughing and having yeah. and like funny moments that happen to everyone so I would describe it more like that I don't, I don't really think it's that scary it's not that scary yeah. not too spooky so like a five-year-old could watch it and they'd be fine yeah, sure. okay yeah. very cool and I mean were you guys actually in Amsterdam or something shot there yeah, yes that's insane four months in Amsterdam yeah the show. Yeah. It's so beautiful there. It looks like a Harry Potter movie, basically. Like all the canals, and it's just, oh, I loved it so much. I didn't want to leave. So basically, yeah. I need to buy a ticket to Amsterdam and get there as soon as possible. What was the coolest place that you went to while visiting there? Um, oh. Well, I actually, I would say Vondel Park. Yeah. Vondel Park is really beautiful, and it's super big, and... Yeah, I would sometimes just ride a bike over there, and like it's it's really beautiful over there. Also, we got to go to the canals and like actually be on the canals on a boat, which was super cool. Yeah. Like, yeah. Did you guys like drive the boat and maneuver it, or uh, actually did. Thomas yeah. got to drive the boat, which was they I was wouldn't. jealous, but yeah. it's okay. He got You're like he's a little bigger. We'll let him go. <laughs> also, he's from there, so I guess oh, you know, no he would know it. That. Yeah. Gets, gets the waters. Okay, so he kind of like translated and did everything yeah. for you guys. And it's based off a Dutch show. I mean, were you able to meet the cast of that show at all? Um, we were I, almost supposed to meet them, and then something happened, and they never. Well, I actually met Luca. Um, I yeah, I ended up making friends with people that knew her, and then I I met her one night. We had dinner, and she was super super sweet. And I shout out to Luca. Hey. <laughs> um, but yeah, she's adorable and really nice. And is Luca's character similar yes. to yours? Okay, so she would play the Tess version of you. Awesome. And who would you say is most like their character, um, just in the cast? I think Thomas. 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 Yeah. Thomas he's, is the he's most. a little more like sharp than, than Daniel. But okay. I but sure, yeah. but he, he has traits that are like Daniel. <laughs> so essentially, he's playing himself. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. <laughs> we love you, Thomas. <laughs> Thomas, don't watch this interview. Uh, oh, and kind of going into that, um, I wanted to play a little game with you guys of who is most likely to, just based character-wise, to do these things. So who is most likely to pull a prank on the rest of the family? You. Yeah, probably me. Yeah. Your, your character. Yeah, Max. Max would be yeah. the one to do that. And what? In real life, yeah. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. So they basically based Max off of your other castmate. <laughs> the prank-wise, baby. Just a little bit? Yeah. And what kind of pranks would Max pull? Uh, he would like, I don't know, something silly, like put a, like a fart thing when you sit down or something stupid like that. Or like he would just okay. make you trip or like yeah, he would like yeah. smoke machine smoke or just machine. flour to the I face. That's, that's really elaborate. Yeah, Damn. He, he just has like a closet full of all these things. Yeah. yeah just, It'd be kind of like what's um, Megan from Drake and Josh, how she has like yes. this like, oh, yeah, secret yeah. layer yeah. with all yeah. this crazy stuff. Very cool. And you did mention farts, so I have to ask, who's most likely to fart and blame it on somebody else? Probably Dan. I think Dan. <laughs> yeah, I think Dan. I'm so sorry. Yeah. Dan. I'm so sorry. Yeah. But yeah, he would most likely yeah. do that. He'd be like, oh my god, did you hear that? Yeah. Like, yeah did you? Oh my god, it scared me. Came is, from you. Is that weird. someone in the house? Yeah. <laughs> He's like, it's a ghost. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. And last one, um, who's most likely to laugh at their own joke? Kira, maybe? Is she? Yeah. In real life, me, but okay. character wise, I think Kira. Kira. Because yeah. I've seen her, like, sometimes, and she'll giggle, and I'm like, oh, what? Yeah. <laughs> like, it wasn't funny, but okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> as long as you have the confidence, I laugh at my own jokes all the time. I think I'm the funniest person in the world, so, you know? Yeah. yeah. I'm funny. I, I do that a lot, though. Mm -hmm. I do laugh at my own jokes, and then I'm like, oh, I'm alone in my house. Yeah. That was a good joke. Just, just write it all down, you know, stand-up comedy later on. And I did see that you are a gamer girl, which oh, yes. is super, super badass, by the way. Thank so you. cool. Um, do we see a little bit of that in Tess in the show? Actually, you don't. Uh, and that's a shame, because I, I love video games, and I have almost every system. Uh, even going back to the original NES, like, oh, wow. all the way up. Yeah, I love video games, and that's, like, my passion. I just got the new Switch. And I love it. I love the Zelda game, and I've been playing that nonstop. But 
Yeah, I absolutely love video games, and I, I hope maybe season two they'll add in video games with Tess. Just like a just, just a little more, maybe. Mm -hmm. She'll put down the books for a second. She definitely has the attitude for it that I see in the trailer, so very cool. Well, thank you guys so much. It was thank so you. fun talking to you. Of course. Thank